Do you date your customers? Jeff Cowan here. Thanks for watching and listening. A few years back, I got married for a second time to the most beautiful person in the world. Candy truly is the love of my life, and I never want anything to come between us. With that in mind, prior to walking up to the altar to get married, I asked my best man, who is my dad, who has been married for over 50 years, if he had any advice. Without hesitation, he simply said, don't ever stop dating her. If you do, someone else will. Wow. Profound, simple, eloquent, and true. Taking his advice, I now find myself in the happiest relationship I've ever been in, one that I believe could never be exceeded. I took my dad's advice and to this day still date my wife. I buy her flowers for no reason like I did before our marriage. I take her out to nice restaurants just like I did when we were dating. We have a standard date night that falls on every Friday where we go to dinner and a movie, just the two of us with no phones, no kids, no interruptions, just me and her. We schedule at least one hour a day when I'm at home that is reserved for television, talking, or whatever. And we never ever lay down and go to sleep or part company without telling each other, I love you. I treat her like gold because I never want anything to happen to us. So why am I sharing this with you and what does it have to do with selling? I think it could be related to you and your customers and the relationship you have with each of them. Do you still date your customers? Do you still do the types of things to keep their business as you did to earn it in the first place? Have you told them thank you recently or sent them a simple thank you note? I have found customers to be just like spouses. If you stop dating them, someone else will. Thank you for listening and watching. Right, wrong, or indifferent. That's the way I see selling from my perspective.